the 27th, we are in the camp in Lithuania, Mediskaya. And we want to, we are here to talk about the problem. Who, who came up? We saw it on social media that the black girls, the African girls in the camp, they uh, beat, uh, bite a policeman, three different policemen, one single woman, which is not true. There are a lot of stuff going on in this camp who we need to make the world know and all the things that are happening. Firstly, the maltreatment. Secondly, the racism. Thirdly, pregnant women are dying. There are sick mothers in here. There are uh, sisters who can barely come out. You see the population in this world, this is not all the African women in this camp. But because, because of one or two reasons, all of them couldn't get out of their beds because they are very sick. And when they are sick, and when we are sick, the only thing we get from the health facility is ibuprofen. No matter what your illness is, even if you have been taken to the hospital, you have, they have nothing to give you but ibuprofen. So we are here to make a point today, not to the world, that all this needs to stop. We need human rights. We need the, the, the African organization, the women empowerment organization, to see into this situation because we are really going through a lot. First, I want to talk about the environment. We're in a camp of about 300 women, about 150 something African women, and we have only one microwave in the kitchen, and that's where we make hot water, and that's where we microwave our food. Just imagine that they need to give food to 300 women, and all of them need to microwave the food in, food in the evening. Just imagine how long it will take. And you know now it's very cold, we don't even have the opportunity to take hot water, because we don't have 